Hey guys, it's Ronnie. For today's baking video, we're going to be making some cookies. I'm just going to start with my cookie dough recipe. I do have a recipe on my channel if you want to check it out. It'll be super easy. But then I'm just going to be taking my rolling pin with my space bands and I'm just going to roll um, my dough. And I do have a DIY on this one as well. I'm just going to use my this round cookie cutter and I'm just going to cut a few cookies. Then I'm just going to take this other cookie cutter. It, this is, I believe, for leaves. And this is the big one on the set. And I think it's from Wilton. I'm not real sure. But you can take anything that has like that pointy end. And I'm just going to cut kind of like one side. Not all the way to the middle, but just one kind of like side. Then I'm just going to take my cutted cookie. I'm just going to guide myself so all my cookies are evenly cutted. Once I have done that, once I have done that, I'm just going to smooth all the like corners or edges because I want it to be not as pointy but more like round. And at this point, they look like kind of Pac-Man. But we're not going for that in this one. Once I have done that, I'm just going to take a straw. You don't need that much, so I'm just going to get that much. So it's easier for me to handle. And then I'm just going to make a bunch of holes in there. So my straw is going to be like the cookie cutter that I'm going to be using to cut like the hole in there that these palettes have. And at this point, it definitely looks like Pac-Man. Yeah, I'm just going to remove like the uh, cookie dough that I cut it with my toothpick. I chose to use a straw because it has like the size that I wanted to go for. You can use a piping tip as well, but not everybody has a piping tip that is in this size. So I just uh, decided to give it a try with the straw. Then they go to the oven for about eight minutes and 350. But just keep an eye on them because every oven is different. Just until they are golden brown on the edges. Once I have done that I'm just going to take my royal icing. I do have a recipe on this one and I'm just going to take my Ziploc bag and I'm just going to first make the outline then I'm going to make that line separating this part because I don't want my hole to be covered in icing so that's why I did that and then I'm just going to fill the whole thing in and the consistency of my icing is quite loose, looser than what I like to work with but I just added a bit more water than what I should have but as you can see nothing happened here and I'm just going to take my scribe tool and I do have a drill on my channel realizing it's dry I'm just going to go ahead and add the paint for that I'm using different shades of like realizing but with different shades of like food coloring on them and my consistency of icing is it's a lot uh, stiffer I went for this consistency because of how I kind of visualized acrylic paint on a palette and you want to kind of like make it not as loose real sorry about my hair I know it looks kind of gross hopefully it doesn't really gross you out but uh, I'm still trying to work on the best angle where I can place my camera and where my head is not like in the way. Hopefully it doesn't really gross you out. And I'm just going to carry on with all my colors. And I'm using red, yellow, green, blue and purple. My purple was a lot looser because again I was using a lot of water and I was running out of it actually. I just wanted to give you this idea and to kind of arrange I'm using my scrap tool but yeah this is pretty much the idea i wanted to share i actually got inspired from the internet i saw this idea that i'm going to link on my blog which is going to be below but i just want to try the idea with my own twist to it anyways i just hope you like them if you do don't forget to give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel for more stuff share it and don't forget to check out my blog i do have close-up photos in there so thank you so much for watching and i'll talk to you later bye guys